I created Pure Press Base as a response to Amazing Base, which is a loose mineral and was our first product. And it worked very well. So the doctors and aestheticians took it as part of their, their procedures. I got a call saying, could you please make this press so we don't, we're not spreading powder all over our exam rooms? And that was when we started on the search to find out how we could press it, not use uh, some of the traditional chemicals that are used in, um, in pressing powders. It was important for us to make pure breast space refillable so that we could cut down on the number of compacts that are thrown into landfills. You know, you can't be a human being without impacting whatever you touch, but at least you can try your best to make that touching as minimal as possible. So you just take your press, leave refill, and you pop it in the compact, and there you have it. Why did I choose minerals to form pure press base? Well, really it was the minerals that chose us because when we started to look at traditional makeup and take out all the things that we didn't like, uh, such as talc and other uh, synthetics and chemicals, what we were left with were the pure minerals. And that gave us really concentrated pigment and wonderful sunscreen protection. And so we learned how to work with them to create a powder that allowed the skin to breathe and function normally and also give it protection as well as holding uh, moisture to the skin. So it was really the minerals that led the way. Pure Space is good for almost every skin type for any number of reasons. What happens when you wear minerals is that they act like little overlapping fish scales on the skin and they hold moisture to the skin. So your uh, dry skin finds that it is actually the moisture lasts longer and their skins are more hydrated. Uh, the minerals tend to control oil, so for oily skins. For sensitive skin, they're fantastic because there are no sensitizers in, in, the, in Pure Breast. We've tested this on highly chemically sensitive women and uh, they've all been fine. Oh, it was also great for, for acneic skin because it allows the skin to breathe and function normally. You know, it's hard to find, hard to think of a skin type that the Pure Press Base and Amazing Base um, doesn't work well for. So why are primers and the hydration sprays uh, an important uh, accessory to Pure Press Base? Well, things always hold to the skin better if they're slightly moist. So the primer adds that sort of foundation, if you will. It's like priming a wall for paint. You would put on a primer first and that holds the paint tighter. And this is what happens with Pure Press and the primer. The primer also has skincare benefits. So it's going to uh, not only make the skin moist and receptive to the minerals, but also helps to calm the skin. I find I use it if I have any kind of sensitivity. I put the primer on and it's, it's, uh, it's really like a balm for the skin. And then the hydration sprays, what happens with minerals is when you wear it for long enough, it takes on the body's natural uh, moisturizers and it really sets into the skin. The hydration sprays hasten that process. So it never looks like powder, it looks like your skin only better. My routine every morning is hyaluronic acid, the HA serum. As soon as I come out of the shower, I put that on because that's when the skin's most receptive. Then I do trim tint, and then I brush over Pure Pressed with my handy brush. And then I give a spritz with Pond Mist. If I'm being really fussy and I've got something to do like this video, for example, I'll use my Darling Smooth Affair, which I love to death. But I use this for all kinds of different things. I use it for a primer, but I use it on my hands. If I've got something that's, you know, I get a blister on my foot, I put this on. I don't know, for me, this is an amazing, soothing, um, healing product.